gymnasts, it's me, Miss Ashley. I'm missing you guys so, so very much and I hope you guys are doing it well at home. Today I'm here with some exercises, more for our gymnasts, but our older boys and girls can also join in like our ninjas and whiz kids too. Now we're gonna work on our upper back flexibility and we're gonna work on our handstands and some progressive handstands too. So. For this one, you're gonna need a nice, clear wall space. So just like I've got behind me. And you can, just as I have, have a mat down on the floor or a towel, something to protect your head just so you don't fall and hurt yourselves. So we're gonna start with some very, very basic wall taps. Okay, so boys and girls, we're gonna start with our backs to the wall. You're gonna take a couple of steps forward. Now this will depend on how far you are, on how much back flexibility you already have. So if you only have a little bit, you're gonna be a lot closer to the wall. And if you're very flexible, you're gonna be a lot further away. So we're gonna start with our feet shoulder width apart. We're gonna put our arms up high in the air. And we're gonna take a big breath in. And as we breathe out, we're gonna bend back to touch the wall. So ready, we're gonna breathe in. And breathe out. And up. Good job, we're gonna do that a couple of times. So breathe in. And out. And tap. Good job. We're going to do three more. So breathe in and out and tap. Two more guys, you're doing really well. Breathe in and out and tap. And one more, breathe in and out and tap and up. Good job. Now we're going to make it a little bit harder. So this time we're going to go up, we're going to go down and touch the wall but we're gonna walk our hands a little bit further down. So watching carefully, I'm gonna breathe in, I'm gonna breathe out, and walk my hands halfway down, and come all the way back up. So you ready? We're gonna do that two times, and go further each time. So arms up, breathe in, and breathe out, and halfway down, and up. Good job, one more. We're going a little bit further this time. If you cannot touch the floor, I want you to go as far as you can. So let's arms up, breathe in, and breathe out, and go as far as you can. Good job, and all the way back up. Well done, boys and girls, good job. Now, we're gonna turn to face the wall this time, and we're gonna work on our handstands, okay? So, we're gonna do a basic kick up, we're gonna rest our bodies against the mat, and then we're gonna kick back down. So watching very carefully, you can take a big step backwards this time. Our arms up in the air, we're gonna do a big lunge forwards. So our front knee is bent, and our back leg is straight. I'm gonna put my hands down and do a big kick, kick. And hold. And kick down. Arms up. Good job, we're gonna do that one more time. Feet together. We're gonna to put our foot forward. Arms up, and kick, kick, and hold, and down. Good job, gymnasts. Keep practicing that one at home. Now, I'm gonna make it a little bit harder. So we're gonna kick into our handstand, but we're gonna walk our hand back out towards the way we have come from, okay? So we're gonna keep our feet touching the wall, and we're gonna arch our backs into a nice back bend. So are you ready? Feet together, watching me if you need to, if you don't understand. I'm gonna do a big lunge, arms up. I'm gonna kick up into my handstand. I'm gonna walk my hands out, arch, and come back up. So make sure you have a go at that one. It's really, really good for you, okay? I'm gonna do one more for you guys today, and this is gonna work on our flexibility as well. So, we're gonna face the opposite way, so our back is towards the wall. And for this one, we can go as close to the wall as we need to. We're gonna put our strong arms down on the floor, as if we're gonna do a handstand. We're gonna rest on one leg, and we're gonna push our other leg up against the wall into our split position. So watching carefully, hands down. I'm gonna push my leg back, and stretch, and down. I'm gonna keep doing that on each leg. I'm gonna hold it longer and longer, so I'm going to do my other leg, which is my weaker leg, and stretch, and down. I want you guys to practice that, I want you to hold it a little bit longer each time, because the longer you do it, 
the more flexible you're gonna get and that helps so much in gymnastics, okay? Have a go at these exercises, guys, and I'll see you guys really soon.